and welcome back to my channel and today is Sunday. Sunday and it's only girls here today yes it's Sunday um, we actually woke up pretty early today my son and my husband are at my um, brother-in-law's house and um, they're doing boy stuff so yeah so they're gonna be over there for a little while and I'm gonna be here with the girls we're gonna be filming I'm gonna give them breakfast right Jamie yeah. We're going to um, get breakfast started. We're going to film. And then after that, we're going to head out. I think we're going to Toys R Us. And I'm not sure where else. So, yeah. I invite you guys to stay tuned for the rest of our vlog. See you later. Bye. Bye. <laughs> yes, they're playing. We'll see you guys later. Bye. Okay. So, I am making some breakfast now. And I just wanted to take a minute to explain to you guys why I haven't been doing a lot of vlogs. Um... I have a back problem and I've had this back problem since my ice skating accident and I was I believe 11 years old when it happened. Um, I really, really hurt my back. Um, I was not supposed to be walking ever again. I was of course never going to be able to have kids and by the grace of God I am here, I am walking, I can run and I, as you know I have a family now. And um, that accident was, um, it really changed my life in so many different ways. And it was very hard for me to get back onto just doing regular things like everybody else would, just walking, sitting, getting up from, a, from the couch or from a chair. It was very, very difficult for me for a very long time. And um, I ended up going to a chiropractor, which by the way, Dr. Mike is awesome, and um, he is the reason. And I, and him, and God, obviously, because God put me in His hands. And um, and I thank him, and I thank God for letting me be able, you know, to have a family, to to be able to run, to be able to walk, and um, it's it's very, very. I'm very, very thankful for that. Now, um. Even though I've gone, I've been with him, with my chiropractor since the accident. And when I first saw him, he honestly told me, how are you even walking? How are you not stuck in a bed? And, and when he showed me my, my x-rays on my back and he told me what was wrong with me. And I understood perfectly fine why, because I was feeling so many different things. And, um... He said, 65% of your spine has been damaged. And when you hear 65%, he's like, yeah, you should be a total, you should be in bed. Like, literally, you should be in bed. You couldn't, I don't know how you're walking. So, like I said, God. And um, even though I go, I don't see him as often as I used to because where I live is about, he's about two hours away. And so um, right now we only have one car and my husband, he works from Monday through Friday. So my car is is not open on the weekends. And in order for me to go, I have, he has to get a day off. So I haven't gone in a, a couple of months. And um, when I don't go see him, um, some of the things that he usually fixes for me start coming back. Um, so, um, it's not with the same intensity, obviously, as before, but I need an alignment. I need to get checked out. I need, I need him to work on my back. And so, um, for example, um, right now, because I've been editing so much, because I am trying to keep up with his vlogs every day, and you guys do understand, um, I have three other channels that I have to, um, I have to film and edit and all of that. I haven't been able to do most of it because I haven't been feeling very well. This week has been very hard on me. Um, my hips, they, I seriously, I think this is how old people feel, like really old people who have, you know, back problems and hip problems that, you know, you barely see, you, you see them walking, but it, it takes them a while to get down to do something. That's the way I am. Um, if I am not careful, it gets to the point where my hips lock. Um, my hips will lock or um, they feel, my hips feel very, very, very 
tender. It's kind of like a feeling as if they're going to give out on you. So I have that and I've been having it for the whole week because I've been sitting so much and, um, and it's just been very hard. I get, I get back problems like back pain, um, from my mid up, um, numbness in the middle of my back. Um, all of my shoulders, my upper back gets very, very, very tired very easily. So for instance, like most of you ladies, obviously you guys have to wash dishes. I have a dishwasher, but I don't like using it just because, um, I don't know. I just don't like using it. And then my kids, um, my kids right now, my oldest helps me wash dishes or the girls help me wash dishes. But whenever I have to wash the dishes, if I'm standing there for more than five minutes, my whole mid back all the way to my arms, it just starts giving out on me. And it's so painful that the pain goes all the way up to my neck. And I also get very, very intense headaches. And okay, ladies. So as I was explaining to you about my battery died. So, um, baby, can you turn it down just a little bit so I can finish vlogging? Thank you, baby. A little more. They love listening to their My Little Pony uh, music. It's really, really nice. Um, so as I was saying, um, I have a very hard time sometimes and, um, you know, I can seriously count on one hand how many times I've woken up and felt great. And when I mean great, I mean I had no pain in my body. And I remember, and it's, it was only, seriously, it was only one day. Since after the accident, I've only had that once happen. And like I told you guys, I get a little emotional just because sometimes you take things for granted. And, you know, being able to just wash dishes, cook a meal, sometimes it's very hard for me. And honestly, it, it is. And like I said, um... Everybody in my family knows that I'm always in pain. Everybody knows, my mom, my sister, I mean, everybody knows that there's always something wrong with me. Um, but I don't think, I don't think anybody knows how painful it is and how horrible it is to have pain every day from the moment you wake up to the moment you go to bed. And, um, but I am thankful. I am thankful because I was able to have my kids. I am thankful because I'm able to move. I'm able to do it. Even if it's it's not as easy, I'm still able to do it. I'm still able to wash dishes. I'm still able to carry my kids. Like I said, not like I want to, not for a very long time, but I still get to do it. So I look at it as a blessing and, uh, and I'm thankful. Don't get me wrong, I think about the future and I think about how I'm going to be in a couple of years and I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. So I need to enjoy this time that I have and do as much as I possibly can. Now the other thing that doesn't help me is my weight. Um, my chiropractor wants me to be down to the size that I was before. and um, But with my whole thyroid problem it's been very hard on me so um the medication that the doctor had given me um was not helping me and when i mean it was not helping me yeah it was helping me i wasn't retaining as much water i was losing weight but i had so many mood swings and it was making me really nauseous and it was just it was just a lot of things so I'm looking still for an alternative, something else that's gonna help me to get better and um, to help me balance all of this out. So yeah, I have a couple of things on me and that is the reason why I haven't been able to vlog that much because like I said, even just sitting here, it's sometimes uncomfortable um, and um, it gets a little hard on me sometimes. And like I said, I am not super woman, not super mom. Um, but I really do try to do my best as a mom. I really try my best. And like I said, sometimes it's a little hard. But I hope you guys understand. I don't think I'm going to be able to vlog every day. I think I'm still going to be doing maybe like once or twice. But for sure, I will be doing the weekend vlogs. Those I can do. 
and then throughout the week like I always do my hauls and other things that I do so I hope you guys um, uh, understand and um, I do apologize I'm not gonna be able to keep up with that many vlogs but I tried but it was just a little too much from for me to take so I'm sorry um, but I hope you guys still um, enjoy uh, whenever I vlog and I thank you guys so much for supporting me and everything that I do on my channel it really means a lot um, I haven't been on it since Friday um, yesterday I kind of saw a couple of videos but I haven't really been able to comment and all of that so I'm gonna get that done probably tonight or tomorrow and yeah so that is it for today well for right now um, like I said, I'm going to be going out and I will take you guys with me. Alright, so I'll talk to you guys really, really soon. Okay, ladies, so we... Sunday! <laughs> He's too late on it. Okay, we already said it was only the girls in the morning. So we came to a different shopping center and um, the weather here was a little less hot. Still uh, warm, but not as bad as warm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, we ended up going to Toys R Us. And then from there we ended up going to the 99. But um, what is it? We didn't get anything at that Toys R Us because it'll be scandalous. Yeah, so we're gonna just go back to our regular spot, and we ended up stopping at the 99 because our drive is about how long, baby? Just an hour ten. An hour Wait. ten, yeah. Back home, so we got some roasted honey peanuts and some fun dip. Yeah, the kids got fun dip, and I got some Cheetos with lime. With well, lemon. And when you mix this with this, it is delicious. It's it is heaven. really, really good. My husband, for a second, he thought he was... I tasted a hamburger with the lettuce. Like, I love shredded lettuce in my hamburgers. And I swear to God, it tasted like lettuce. I, like a delicious, juicy cheeseburger right off the grill. The exit was right there. That's how good it was. Like, seriously, it was really, really good. So, we're a little bouncy because my husband is driving. So, excuse us. Um, so, yeah. So, we're going to go back. Um, I don't know if we're going to continue vlogging. If We probably will until we get home. We probably will when we get to Toys R Us. Uh-huh. So, I'll see you ladies in a little bit. Okay, ladies. We are back home and... Um, I'm gonna show you um, some of the groceries we bought today. We bought groceries about two days ago, so these are just kind of like the last few items that we needed. Um, and yeah, so um, it was a very long day. Um, my husband drove for a while, but overall we had a great time with the kids. And um, let me just show you real quick, okay? Okay, ladies, so here we go. We got some chicken. Uh, breast tenderloins we got some water um, we got some gluten-free waffles some eggs in the back we have some organic ketchup oh which by the way it's delicious and we got some coconut milk for my son um, we got some apple juice we got more of these turkey chili with beans it's so good um, mayo um, we got some maple and this is agave syrup blend. It is so good. And we got some hash browns. And these I think I've showed you guys before. This is banana cream. And this one's for strawberries. I got some tomatoes. We got some honey nut O's. Some frosted flakes. Trader Joe's. Um, we got a head of lettuce. We got some banana. And we got some zucchini. And... Of course, of course, of course, the very cherry berry blend. And I don't think I've shown you guys this. These are the chicken breakfast sausage, and they are super, super good. So, yeah, that was it pretty much for tonight, for today. I hope you guys all enjoyed this vlog, and I hope all of you have a beautiful, beautiful week. Till next time, ladies, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.